Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So it's been a while, I think it's five, six months already since I last posted a video in general regarding of my traveling or my uh, you know, luxury unboxing content. Anyway, today we have a new unboxing video. Look, oh, this is the first time that I actually um, bought from this company. I don't know how to say the name, is it Satire or something? And yeah, let's get started together. I don't know what to expect since this is the first time that I got from them. So I've got a big one, some tissue paper. Oh, nice. Okay, so we've got this big box. Put it away and there you go in the plastic wrap. Ta-da. I kind of wish that they bow it up. They just give me play like that and I love you know you know how how much I love packaging but anyway let's open it together Whoa So inside the box is just this um blanket itself and the box Actually for me like in terms of all the um luxury brand packaging I think Burberry has of Burry has one of the best, if not the best, packaging. I really, really enjoy their um, older version of the box and the packaging in general. It looks so luxurious, but this one, it's a bit more streamlined in a way, but it still looks good. And I love the kind of like pistachio color inside as well. We got some silicon package here and that's it. It doesn't really say where the box is from, but yeah, this is it pretty much. So yeah, it doesn't really say much about where the box is from. Um, unlike Louis Vuitton, where it says, you know, it's either Vietnam or in Italy, and the lid, it just say Burberry, London, England. Anyway, let's go back to the um, blanket itself. So the blanket itself, it smells really fresh. Mm. Um, the measurement, I believe, is 110 centimeter time 98 centimeters and this is the tag the original price in australia is 440 australian dollars but when i got this on the internet from the website it was on sale for 334 and 15 cents so it's about 25 percent off so i'm quite happy with the purchase i don't want to you know um let me see if i can open it up a little bit it's quite big there you go Look, so I think this is the length and yep, so you got fringes on two sides, so this one side and the other side is here. So this will be a family scarf, um, I will be sharing this with my mom as well because she always looking for this kind of like shawl like um scarf rather than you know the skinny one where you can just put around the neck this one you can actually use it some sort of like a poncho let me try or like a blanket itself you know it's easy um and it works for both men and women and that's really nice the fabric itself is so soft and i'm not sure if you could see it um the fray of the the actual material itself it's quite thick, but you can actually see the lights as well, so it's not too thick. And this is the brand name. I would be so unhappy if this one is made in China, but let me find the tag first. It is made in Scotland as it was advertised. You know, in so I did a lot of research before I bought this, and some of the websites actually say made in the United Kingdom and some of the websites actually say made in Scotland so this one says made in Scotland and these are the tags that it come with so it is winter time in Australia right now as I am filming Perfect weather to use this and my mom's actually standing on my right hand side at the moment and um, watching me doing this um, Yeah, so we're going to try it on. Thank you so much for watching my video I hope you enjoyed it if you want to follow me check out my Instagram and my other um, Unboxing videos as well. I put all the links down below. Um, yeah, you can check out my Gucci, Louis Vuitton and my other shopping blog as well Thank you once again, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day